And now to an Israeli startup that claims it can boost your portfolio by uncovering superior investment opportunities. I know First is a fintech company that provides AI-based algorithmic forecasting solutions for the capital markets. And joining us now from Tel Aviv to tell us all about it is CEO and co-founder Yaron Golger. Good to have you with us, Yaron. Thank you for having me. All right, Yaron, your website says that you have developed a system to, quote, uncover the best investment opportunities. So tell us how you do that. So we are utilizing artificial intelligence, more specifically artificial neural networks, in order to predict the financial markets and identify the best uh, opportunities on a daily basis. Um, our predictive algorithm is generating daily forecasts for over 10,500 assets from different asset classes, uh, equities, commodities, currencies, word indices, interest rates uh, for different time frames, short term, mid term and also long term. And among those different uh, asset classes, the algorithm is identifying the best opportunities on a daily basis. Um, the algorithm, the predictive algorithm uh, is covering most of the world uh, stock exchanges, over 50 global stock exchanges, including the stock exchanges in the US, uh, Canada, uh, but also the stock exchanges in uh, Europe and Asia. All right, Yaron, can you give us an example of a trade in any asset class that your AI predicted and that when that trade was executed, in fact, it did deliver results? So I think the most interesting uh, stock uh, or the hottest stocks this week uh, was Tesla. And we started to see uh, bullish signals uh, for Tesla uh, already two weeks ago. Uh, we all know that, uh, you know, what happened the recent, uh, recent week with, uh, with Tesla, but this is just an example. Um, the most interesting thing about this predictive algorithm is that each forecast uh, actually comes with confidence level. Uh, in the financial markets, there are assets that are predictable and there are assets that are not predictable. Um, but uh, we managed to develop a predictive algorithm that providing the clients um, confidence level of each forecast. So every uh, user basically can focus on the most predictable assets on a daily basis in order to announce his own uh, portfolio. All right, so Yaron, let's go back to that Tesla example because the stock did have a major run-up and then pretty significant drop afterwards. Tell us what your algorithm Correct. predicted and what it forecast in terms of the short-term trade execution. So we started to see a bullish uh, signals for, uh, for Tesla um, two weeks ago. Um, after the major jump uh, um, this week, we started to see uh, actually negative signals for the short term. Um, while for the long term, we still see that this specific stock is, might be interesting for one year from now. But for the short term, this stock is going to suffer from some volatility. Um, Tesla is just an example. Um, you know, the predictive algorithm is uh, generating daily forecast for over uh, 60 word indices every day, um, over 5,000 assets, mainly in the U.S. We are covering all the S&P 500 right. index, for, for example. And so, so to be uh, clear, every day there are different opportunities. So, so just to help our viewers understand, your algorithms identify an asset class right. and say, now is the time to buy this, we predict a run-up, for example. So in order to generate the prediction, our algorithm is, is relying on quantitative uh, data set that, uh, that we are collecting all the time, every day, around the clock. We are adding the daily feed into our own uh, database. We are uh, managing okay. database with historical data. And, actu and actually around the clock, the algorithm is learning identifying the patterns in the market and generating the forecast for the next uh, near future and mid also midterm right. and also for the long term. Act All right. Actually, the algorithm is con constructing the complex network that exists in the financial market, the hidden correlation set between the different assets, between the different right. asset classes uh, in order to generate the forecast. Okay, Diaron, very interesting stuff. Thank you okay. so much.